I did my PhD in ethnographic study with second generation male uh, Muslim drug dealers that I essentially accompanied in their daily lives uh, for five years. And my PhD then looked at um, the relationship between social exclusion and how they saw themselves in Germany, how they formed an identity. I'm always trying to sort of like illuminate the perspectives of, the, of both those who work uh, in the system, but also those who encounter criminal justice institutions. I'm particularly interested in how interactions with the criminal justice system are shaped by various factors of exclusion and marginalization. And so what I want to do with the Tory chair then is to study precisely the barriers that are in place when people are being released into the community. What sort of services do they have? Um, we have many services in place, such as housing, food, mental health supports, medical support, me treatment options, etc. But these services seem to fail at some point for most of our participants so that they unfortunately return to prison. We have just been able to build the Center for Criminological Research within the sociology department. Really uh, the only such research center in Western Canada. And we see the center, I can speak for all of my colleagues, I think, um, as a think tank that brings together um, key stakeholders in the community, um, uh, community groups and academics to essentially think about what are the most prevalent issues uh, with respect to the criminal justice system and those who encounter the system. The biggest motivation for everything I do is to try to at the end of the day, translate my findings in, and my knowledge into best practices and create, hopefully, positive system changes.